Hey guys, Martin Bennett here from The Loan Room. I'm going to talk to you about why you cannot save your way to wealth and a successful financial future and retirement. You see, gone are the days when you put your money in the bank and earn 9, 10, 11% interest. Today, you're lucky to earn 1% on your money. So, if you go back and you do the real numbers on what you need to retire on, it's going to be scary because we've been taught a million dollars is a lot of money. Today, a million dollars is not a lot of money. This is why I say you cannot save your way to retirement. Let me give you an example. Let's just pretend you're earning $75,000 a year on average for a 40 year working life. You would have earned $3 million over your working life. You might say, well, that's a lot of money. You've paid tax in that money, so you may be left with $1.5 million, maybe $2 million depending on your tax bracket. You pay your bills, your rent, your food, there's nothing left over. You then hope that little bit of money every month that goes into the super is going to be enough to create a nest egg for you to enjoy your retirement. I don't want to be that person and say it's not going to happen, but it's not going to happen. So what is the solution? If we have a problem there, which for 99% of people, I believe you cannot save your way to wealth. What is the solution? Simple. We need to look at investing our way to wealth. What I mean by investing, it's creating a plan, creating a strategy outside of your contributions to superannuation that's going to enable you to build a big enough nest egg to give you a wealthy, financially free future. I believe I love real estate. Real estate gives you leverage. Real estate over the long term historically goes up in value. Real estate provides consistent, regular cash flow. So if you're looking to create wealth, the first step you need to do is actually work out how much do you need to retire on. In today's dollars, you see $100 today most likely is worth a whole lot less in 10, 20, 30 years time than it is today. So you want to work out how much you need in retirement assets, in retirement income in today's dollars. And don't kid yourself, I don't believe when you stop working, you need less. I would say you probably need more, more health costs, more travel costs. You want to actually enjoy your life. So rule number one is work out what you need. That may be a scary figure for you, but it's so important to know, hey, what do I need to get to and have a goal? Now, if we can't save our way to wealth, what do we need to do? Well, we can look at borrowing our way to wealth. Yeah, I said it, borrowing your way to wealth. You can use other people's money, the banks, to buy real estate assets. And if you buy the right real estate assets, you can accumulate quite a large nest egg of real estate that gets paid off over time. So you can quite comfortably, comfortably build a four or five million dollar asset pool in retirement by using the power of leverage, by using the power of debt, if it's done in the right way. Just a really quick disclosure, hey, this is not financial advice, make sure you speak to your financial planner or accountant, but do your homework here. Do the numbers, what you need. Saving your way to wealth, I don't believe has ever really worked, it's about investing. And you need to find a way to invest more than 10% of your income. You see, the only reason to save is to save enough money to put a down payment on a property, to put a down payment on a business or an investment. There's no other need to save your money apart from building up a large enough asset base to invest. Guys, I hope this has sparked some interest. I hope this has sparked some thoughts. I encourage you, go back and do your own homework. Look at what you really need to be able to retire on. Don't just listen to a financial planner who's gonna sell you into products. Do your own homework. Work out what it is. If you're scared of that number, if you wanna have an idea of how that can happen for you, hey, we'd love to guide you through that. We'd love to have a conversation with you. Reach out to us here at The Loan Room, how you can build your investment portfolio. Till next time, have a great day.